So for this problem, we have predict the dipole moment of this bond, N and O, and so electronegativity increases until fluorine and increases up until fluorine. So now we just compare N and O. So N is right here and O is right there. We zoom in. So if N is right here and O is right there, which one's more electronegative? Well, the trend is that it increases this way. That means since oxygen is to the right of N, oxygen will actually have a more electro, it, it will be more electronegative. That means the arrow will point towards oxygen. Therefore, giving oxygen a partially negative charge, that's all this means, and then a partially positive charge. So I hope that helped, and thanks for watching.